Welcome back. In this lesson, we're going to talk about the photo calendar and the photo collage. If you choose photo calendar, it's going to say, hey, I need some pictures first. So make sure you select your photos. I'm going to select 1 through 11. We're going to need more than 11 photos for this calendar, obviously, because there's 12 months at least. Go ahead and choose photo calendar. It's going to open up the photo calendar dialog. It's going to ask you what month you want to start with and what year. It's going to choose, you can select autofill with the selected images. And we can choose, let me see here. I saw one that I wanted to try out. I'm going to go ahead and choose Storyteller. And then just click OK. And we'll work its magic. OK, and once it's done, you'll see here this is the title. You can add the title here. You can double click on it to add your own title, to add your own text. Date here, it has four little photos, which is nice. Then you can see this would be your January photo, which is nice. You can zoom in by pressing Z or use the zoom tool. And what's nice is if you zoom in close enough, you can, let me select the move tool, you can right click on the one and say add event and we'll say uh, Chris birthday and then click OK. And I can position this text careful because you have to press Control Z, but make sure you select the text block. And then you can add that right there to one. And so you can add my birthday to January 1st. It isn't, but you can do it. Okay. And as you can see here, we go through the months. And you'll notice that I ran out of photos. So here I can add the same photos if I wanted to, or click and find photos that I wanted to. So that's a nice thing uh, about the photo calendar. Click done or click print. If you click done, we're not going to save it. And we'll talk about the other thing here. So I have the 11 photos still selected. We're going to choose photo collage. It's going to ask you, you can print it locally, of course. You can choose these different options. Let's just choose the first one. They provide one theme for you. They give you a little preview. Just click OK. And then there you have the photo collage. You have the same options here, layout, artwork, and text. OK. If you don't like a photo, just click on it and move it. If you feel that this photo should be on top, then right click and say bring to the front. Okay. If you want to rotate it, you can rotate it at that point. So you have different options um, in the photo collage. You're not limited. Okay. And then when you're happy, you can either click print or done to save it, save it and work on it later. Oh, excuse me, I gotta commit it first. I'm not gonna save it. In the next lesson, we're gonna talk about the slideshow.